new viewer, you subscribing to my channel has been foreseen by the Omnisia. Good morning. Is work going well today, Master Diviner? I am extremely busy of late. If you have something to ask of me, do not delay. You were about to say something along the lines of, How did you know I wanted to ask something? But then you remembered who you were talking to and decided not to bother, correct? Of course. I run a dozen hexagrams before I even get around to breakfast. The results are never far wrong. Today's divinations threw up some unexpected complications. The hexagrammatic position was facilitating between the water and heaven trigrams. The matrix of prescience gave the following interpretation. You will have three uninvited guests. This is ultimately auspicious. Ultimately auspicious? Wow, sounds pretty good to me. Seems like we really were destined to meet today then. You know... I see you've been using the Matrix of Prescience to divine into Kafka's past. Well, I have a similar request. Hmm, I see. You wish to use the Matrix to relive the past and awaken parts of your memory? Viable in principle, but whether the Matrix is truly capable of achieving this result remains to be seen. I knew it. Things are never simple, are they? Kafka's situation was different. I feel I must explain in detail the principles behind the Divination Commission's ultimate weapon to avoid any misunderstandings. The Matrix of Prescience does not allow one to remember anything. It merely collects data in order to infer past events in the same way that future events are inferred. Just as realm-keeping commission officers collect ballistic evidence to recreate the scene of a crime, there are materials from which we can infer the past. These may be items related to the experience or memories of the people involved. Miss March's predicament is very different from Kafka's situation because she doesn't remember what happened in her past. I am no medical professional, but fortunately, I'm very fond of reading. We understand that there are two types of memory loss. One, where the memories remain dormant, floating around in the unconsciousness unable to be awakened. And another, that involves direct erasure of memories from the brain. Something must have happened when I was frozen in the ice. I bet the memories were freezing and decided to hibernate. Why don't we try using the Matrix of Prescience to determine which situation pertains to Miss March? Let's begin then by preparing the requisite inference materials. Miss March, your memory is unreliable. To guarantee the Matrix's accuracy, you'll have to provide something related to your past experience. Anything will do. When you're ready, come and find me in the Matrix Core. 